And then just in terms of the World Test Championship, you, you'll almost certainly end up higher than you did last time. Uh, and I think you can get as high as six. Is, is that something that you guys are looking at? Is it, does it provide some context for you? And, and what's your next cycle going to be like? Well, I think the World Test Championship brought, you know, a good competition to, to test cricket. You know, test cricket before, obviously, you know, they didn't, didn't have, have this every year, every two years. Um, so I think it's good, something to play for. And, you know, so you have one more game left, and we, we, we look forward to obviously doing well. You know, the key for us is to, you know, make West Indians proud. You know, that's always the, the big goal for us. And, you know, the Nets, you know, the Nets um, championship is important for us to, to improve. You know, we, we obviously got to look to, you know, to beat top, top teams in the world. That, that's the, that's how you get points. So, and that's, that's what we got to aim for. I see one raised hand on the Zoom, Gavin Richards. You can unmute yourself and proceed. Good morning, um, Craig. I'm just trying to get a, a sense as to if um, Moti is fit and available for the second match. Well, yeah, Moti, Moti, sh no, we will get a report today, but I think yesterday he had a, he had a ball and it went, it went decent. So I guess later on today we'll get that, you know, from the, from the medical team. And, and the batters really struggled in the first match. Um, are we likely to see any changes in the batting order or, or maybe one or two players coming in for the second match? Well, I mean, we got some, you know, we got some guys, you know, Jermaine and, and Raymond, you know, showing us, you know, how to get runs against this, you know, attack. And, you know, regarding a change, you know, possibly not, um, you know, really backing, backing the guys to, to get the job done. Greg, what would be a real word of advice to the batters? Like you said, um, Jermaine and, and Reaper showed you guys how to how to get runs on the pitch. Um, in the post-match, um, you did make some comments about, um, you know, there's not enough time technically, you know, to do anything. But what basically would be your word of advice? Well, as I said, I mean, test cricket is, is all mental. And it's just to figure out how you want to score runs against each bowler. And, you know, we got some dismissals, you know, some balls were wide. And so it's, it's important to, to have the clarity to know which balls you want to play, which balls you want to leave. And that's, you know, what batting is. You know, it's batting for long periods and, and you know, against world-class bowling and, and knowing how you want to score them. And I think mentally we got to be in that right place to firstly believe we, we could do it, you know, believe we could bat, you know, and score and score runs. And, and then, you know, it's, it's, it's to do it. You know, we, we, we got to do it. It's as simple as that. And Craig, of course, South Africa missing one of their, their key fast bowlers. Um, not here, he's been ruled out of, of the game. Um, in terms of how that affects you guys as well, how you plan for, for the game? Well, I, I won't say it affects us. Obviously, we know he's a, he's a world-class bowler, you know, who has some pace. And, you know, I think whoever comes in for them, obviously, they have two spinners. You know, those guys are obviously good bowlers. So, you know, we, had, we would have seen some footage. A few of the guys played against him already. And as I said, it's important. We, we know how we want to go about it. You know, we, we know how we want to score runs. We know how we want to get singles, rotate the strike, you know, be aggressive to each bowler. It's important we, we, we take these plans into the game. Obviously, a game, you know, it involves a lot of pressure. You know, you're playing test cricket. And it's, it's important to do it when you're under pressure. You know, it's, it's never easy, but, you know, we, we could do it. And I'm, I'm backing the guys 100%. Thank you, Craig. All right, thanks, Craig, and thanks to all of you for attending. We're looking forward to the start of the second test tomorrow here at Wanderers. Enjoy the rest of your day.